How interesting! Sofiso is so excited. His Grade 7 farewell is coming up in three weeks. The Grade 6 learners and their teachers had been fundraising all year to make sure their seniors would be presented with an evening to remember. Sofiso had already asked the nerve-wracking question and he received a yes from his sweetheart, Mabale. So everything is looking bright. Oops. Well, not all that bright. He has nothing decent to wear to such a grand event. His black pants are way too short. His smart shoes squeeze his pinky toes into the corners. His white shirt is, well, not so white anymore. And his tie is, well, that's an easy one. He doesn't have a tie. He decides to approach his dad about his clothing problem. But he knows this will be a tough one because money is not a topic that dad likes to speak about. It always causes him more stress. Dad is already working two jobs since mom passed on a few years ago. So, Sofiso decides to go the formal route. He makes an appointment to meet with Dad to discuss his problem. At the meeting, Sofiso states his case about his need for a new outfit and makes an emotional plea. Dad, it's not that I want to be greedy, I just want the evening to be special. Sofiso, my boy, Dad responds affectionately. I too had these special events in my life as a young man and I remember them fondly. All right, let's see what plan we can come up with together. Sofiso's father covers his face with his hands as though trying to hide from the problem yet knowing he is Sofiso's only solution. Slowly pulling his hands away from his face, Dad says, Sofiso, since mom passed away three years ago, I have put away a little money in a savings account for you. You know, just for in case. Sofiso starts feeling hope building up inside of him. It's a warm feeling and it wants to burst right out of him. Yes, dad, is all he manages to utter. Dad continues. Well... I think this Grade 7 farewell is an event I would like you to celebrate in style, and I know Mom would too. So, here's the plan. I saved 15 Rand every month for three years, which gives us 540 Rand in the savings account right now. Let's say 150 Rand for shoes, 200 Rand for new black pants, 150 Rand for a white shirt and 40 Rand for a tie. Dad scribbles the costs on a piece of paper. That adds up to our... <laughs> 540 Rand, Dad announces. Wow, Dad, you're the best! Sofiso finally explodes with glee. On the big night, Sofiso dresses up in his crisp new clothes. He looks immaculate. Dad gives him a last goodbye hug at the front door and whispers in his ear. There's just one more thing. What, Dad? Did I forget something? Sofiso says in a panic while checking his clothing one last time. Yes! Dad shouts out excitedly as he produces a brand new belt from behind his back. It was awesome! With a huge shiny gold buckle! Dad, that bling, that's my thing! You're cool and you rule! Sofiso breaks out into a spontaneous rap song from sheer excitement. He grabs Dad and gives him a big hard hug. But then he becomes very serious. We can't afford this, he says with a heavy heart as the reality sinks in. Dad holds Sofiso by the shoulders and explains. Sofiso, you'll never guess what happened when I went to draw the savings money at the bank the other day. 
there was extra money in the account after I withdrew the 540 rand. Being the honest man that I am, I inquired about the extra money. Guess what? The extra money is the interest the bank has been paying us over the three years that I have been saving money. Bonus, or what? Wow, the power of money. Oh, thanks, Dad. Guess what I'm going to be doing from now on? Saving! Safiso says, and he puts on his bling belt. He heads off to his grade 7 farewell, rubbing his belt buckle, whispering to himself, I can get this from interest? How interesting! <laughs> <laughs>